and if the audience starts to get up and dance, then, you know, then we know we've done a good job. <laughs> I think the colors of this concerto are what make it unique. We start the concerto on a D trumpet. That D trumpet is very bright and shiny, almost like um, ice pellets falling onto a window. And so the beginning of the concerto is... So that articulation is very crystalline, in my opinion. When we get into the sections that are more like mambo, this is like shiny, red, brassy, brilliant. The third instrument is the flugelhorn. And the flugelhorn is a very round and noble sound, very enveloping. This concerto is uh, really embodying Latin elements in folk song and in dance. But particularly, there's one section that's kumbaya. Kumbaya is like, uh, has a clave beat. And then we have the mambo section, which is something that we would hear, obviously, if for those classical fans that know Leonard Bernstein's West Side Story Suite. There's a famous mambo section, and she really um, develops that. That's the ending of the concerto. I'm looking forward to that moment when it finally comes together, because right now it's mostly in my head, but I won't know until that week what it actually feels and sounds like.